Hello and welcome, this is Mr. Bus. I'm gonna walk you through how to conduct lab eight, the greenhouse effect. So here you see lab eight is set up. I have two beakers, both of them are 600 milliliter beakers, and they've both already been, they're already set like this in the room. They've already been kind of covered up with some insulation, and the only difference between the two beakers is that this one has a plastic uh, cover, and so this one is basically representing a planet with an atmosphere. This one is a planet without an atmosphere. Uh, you probably can't see from the video. I can move it up, but there are uh, there's some soil in the bottom of each beaker that's representing the planet's surface. And the temperature probe, I'll show as well, is connected to a clamp and it is carefully placed so that it is hovering the tip of the temperature probe for both of these is not touching the ground it's basically hovering in the middle of the beaker and the setup takes a little bit of time and care because you really want everything to be the same so don't hesitate to use a half meter stick or something a ruler to get some distances I've got the light bulb about 20 centimeters off the lab table and then the distance, um, how far away the temperature probes isn't crucial as long as it's the same for both of the temperature probes. So you want the temperature probes exactly the same distance away from the light bulb. You want them both in there vertically. One temperature probe shouldn't be higher than the other. The temperature probes shouldn't be resting against the soil. It should be hovering so that the tip of the probe is um, about halfway into the beaker. All right. To run this experiment, it's pretty straightforward. It's gonna be a time-based experiment. Duration 30 minutes, rate 10 samples per minute. Okay? So really what you're testing is, um, you know, what, what's the, gonna be the effect of the cover, which is again, representing an atmosphere on a planet. You're gonna run it for a day night, day. So it's going to run for 30 minutes. So at the start of the 30 minutes, we're going to turn the light bulb on and hit play. So it's collecting data. After 10 minutes, we'll turn the light bulb off. And after 10 more minutes, so 20 minutes total, we'll turn the light bulb back on again. So 10 minutes on, 10 minutes off, 10 minutes back on for 30 minutes total. You don't really have to do anything other than turning the light bulb off and then back on. So you have 30 minutes in which to do some of the book notes, Schoology quizzes, reviewing, or other work that you might have to do. Thanks and let me know if you have any questions.